I'm just going to click on the trade section, right? So I'll click on the trade section here. Then I'll go to P2P. So if I go to P2P and I go to orders, these are all the transactions that I've done this week. Okay. So my features account is around $3,000. But right now, I'm going to show you how to also earn $100 daily from your Binance app. I'm going to show you what I am doing to make this money and how you can also do the same thing. So the first thing is for us to get a verified Binance account. Once you have the verified Binance account, you follow the instructions in this video. You can click the link in the video description if you don't have a Binance account. And please pay close attention. At the end of this video, if you have any questions, you can just comment down below. I will also leave my WhatsApp contact so that you can get in touch with me. So basically what we want to do is we want to click on features here. So once I click on features, I have to transfer money into my features account. For the sake of this video, I'm going to use $500. So I'll just click on transfer at the top right hand side. Some of the things you might not understand, but you need to pay close attention so i'll just click here now deposit 500 dollars into my features wallet so i'll just deposit 500 dollars then i'll click on confirm even if you have 10 dollars or 20 dollars the strategy will still work for you you just have to pay close attention I've been able to deposit money into your features wallet like i have here you can see 504 dollars now we need to find a coin that we are going to buy or sell so that when it increase or decrease in value we'll make profit from it so the best thing to do is you go to a website called coin market cap so this is my coin market cap you can also download it to your android phone or your smartphone or your iphone now when you have the app we have the coins the top 100 coins here we have bitcoin and other alternative coins when I say alternative coins, I'm talking about uh, Ethereum. I'm also talking about BNB and also Solana, right? So we are going to find a coin that we can also sell because when we are looking at Bitcoin here, Bitcoin is falling. And I told you in the last video, if Bitcoin is falling, the alternative coins is just a matter of time. They will also follow because today is Sunday. I will not allow you to trade. So don't trade on weekend saturday and sundays are not good you can trade on monday to friday from the time of 8 a.m in the morning to 4 p.m the reason why we are trading on 8 a.m is because that's the time that the new york session the london session opened the banks in united kingdom open and we have 2 30 p.m that's the time that the new york session also opened during those hours the market usually trend in one direction it will be like the either the market is going up or it's falling so you want to be trading between those hours right so for us to find a coin and trade is simple and straightforward when you open your coin market app make sure you have updated the app right so when you have updated the app okay so for us to find the coin and trade now we are going to click on the search box here you see we have new search portfolio and community just click on the search here the reason why we are clicking on the search is because this is where people are currently trading these are the coins that people are currently investing their money in so you can see we have coins like cyberbank we have pp uma solana floki with we also have btc and fed you want to make sure that you are trading on a coin that people are currently investing in so for me to trade i'll be looking at coins that are listed on binance and bybit and also on pool coin so i can select a coin like fet i can select a coin like with you don't trade btc or the bigger coins the top five coins these coins are not going to make you money and you even lose money so if bitcoin is falling don't go and trade ethereum and solana they'll just reverse on you those coins they take time to follow bitcoin direction okay so what i need to do now is i just have to select a coin a meme coin from this session that has been listed when i say listed on uh binance it has been added on the binance platform that means it's a trusted coin for you to invest your money in so i'll click on the fed ai here or i'll even select this particular coin 
So for me, what I'll do is I'll be looking at these three coins. Pepe, we have with that is also listed on Binance and we have FET. So right now FET is going up. I wouldn't trade it because Bitcoin is going down and this meme coin is going up. So I'll either trade the with here. So after clicking on the with coin, I can even see that we have what we call statistics and we have community we have market where it's listed so all these things are at the top you can find out here we have community so this coin should be on telegram and also on twitter and other stuff the news about the coin and also the market so i told you that i'm going to keep this video simple so bitcoin is currently falling right and we have with also on the listed coins so i'll just go to my binance and sell this particular coin okay but the next video i'll be showing you position sizing and risk management but for now i'll open my binance here and risk like five percent of my i'm going to use like five percent of my account on this coin so i'll just click on the set box here when i click on the set box i'll type in the wave coin okay you always select the ones with the USDT attached to them. Don't go and select any other coin apart from those with the USDT. So what you are currently seeing is we have limit orders and market orders. When you say limit orders, you are simply saying that I want to enter the market at this specific price. But when you say market orders, you want to enter instantly. So if a particular coin, the price is $10 and you select market orders here, that means you want to trade right now you want to enter at ten dollars so for me the current price of with is 2.586 cents right so i'm going to enter at this particular moment we have cross margin and isolated margin when i say cross margin you are using all the money in your features wallet but when you say isolated margin you are dividing the money into just click on the leverage here then i'll increase it to maximum leverage okay if you don't understand risk management don't go for maximum leverage we have single asset mode and multiple asset mode before you can use cross margin usually you have to change it to multiple asset mode now i told you that i'm going to use 10 percent of my account size so for you to use the 10 percent you have to drag this particular triangular button so i'm going to use like five percent don't go beyond five percent so five dollars of the five hundred dollars right now you also add your stop loss and take profit stop loss is where you want to exit the market if the trade is not going in your favor and we have take profit is your targeted price where you want to exit the market should in case the trade goes in your favor anytime you enter the market there is 70 percent chance of you losing your money so you need to be smart some of you just deposit money and start trading that's why when someone texts me i always say let me teach you how to trade before you start taking signals whether you have ten thousand dollars you have one million dollar ten dollars or hundred dollars it's still the same thing i selected five dollars from my five hundred dollars as margin always make sure that even if you are not adding take profit but add your stop loss so you can see I have my stop loss at 2.500. Now, if I want to enter the trade, I'll just click on the sell button, right? So let's let's do it again. I'm going to use the take profit, like we we'll have a take profit of 1.800. Then we have a stop loss of about 2.9. Then we'll click on the sell session okay let's see what is currently happening so let me just add the entry when i enter the market then i'll add my stop loss and take profit so i'll just click on the sell button here so anytime i enter the trade if i use market orders it will appear at the positions so you can see the trade has just appeared at the positions so this is where you know how much you are currently making on the trade. The PNL shows how much you are currently making on the. The margin is how much you have invested on the position, and we also have the margin ratio. That means that I've used like five percent of my five hundred dollars. So the margin ratio will calculate it. The return on investment is the ROI. Anytime you enter a trade, 
and the margin ratio is more than 10 percent please close the trade and reduce your margin if you over leverage before your trade enter into profit you are going to lose all your money so it's very important you understand this if you want you can enter the trade then after that you now add i'm always telling people that close 50 percent of your profit if the trade is going well so for you to close 50 percent of your profit just click on the close position bar here right when you click on the close position you click here to the 50 percent like the middle bar here you see 50 percent then you click on confirm once you click on confirm they are going to add the money that you have made when you are done closing 50 percent now let's say you want to move your stop loss to entry then you click on the tp slash sl click on it when you click on it you click on position tp slash sl you click on position tp slash sl now you use your entry price as your stop loss so maybe let's say we enter a trade or you have entered a trade and you are able to achieve 100 plus roi you close 50 percent and move your stop loss to entry it's very important for you to grow your capital and always be withdrawing money from your account so what i need to do is i'll just enter my stop loss so now the stop loss will no longer be the 1.088 uh the one point the 2.8 uh, it will now be like 2.55 when we say marked price marked price is where the coin is currently at so if a coin is ten dollars and you entered and now you came and the coin is now fifteen dollars fifteen dollars becomes your marked price do you get it the fifteen dollars is now your current price it's now your marked price people are always confusing this the entry price is where you enter the market so i'll enter the 2.552 so we have 2.552 here that will be my entry I'll show you how to make hundred dollars daily from the binance app you can use the same method on KuCoin, Bybit, BitGet, Mexec, OKX. You can use the same strategy on that place. You see, for you to make money online, you need to have a system. You can do drop shipping, affiliate marketing. You can even do CPA marketing. You can do YouTube videos like the way I'm doing. But you need to have a system and you need to learn. If you are not willing to learn, you will not earn. And some of you that's the main reasons why you are losing money you are not willing to pay for the education okay so this video i've just showed you one of the simplest and easiest way to make money in 2024 with your smartphone or your pc if you have one if you don't understand what i've just taught you in this video download it and rewatch it or you can just rewatch it okay if you have any questions just comment down below as i told you the next video i'm going to be showing you risk management and position sizing which is very important i've just showed you how to find a coin and trade it using the trading strategy always follow the trend if bitcoin is falling follow it and fall never catch a falling knife okay don't go and say oh i think the market will go up always follow the trend okay so see you in the next video you are going to learn position sizing and risk management